Hi, I'm Rosie Batista from MyCookNaked.com and I'm here today to show you how to make a cranberry oat bar. No baking. So what we're going to do is we're making this bar really naked, which means food in its most natural form. So we're not using flour or sugar or anything like that. We have oats, we have dates for sweetener, which I've soaked overnight in a little bit of water. We have some pumpkin that's been pureed. You can buy it in the can. We have some cranberries. When you buy dried fruit, you want to make sure you're buying dried fruit that has no sulfur dioxide and preservatives added to it. It's a little hard to find, but worth the search. And some pumpkin seeds. And we're going to sneak in a little dark chocolate. And I love this brand of dark chocolate because it's 60% cacao, which means it has a little bit more of the antioxidants that we want for our body in there. We're just going to use a little and sneak it on top as for drizzle. So the first thing we're going to do is puree our oats in the blender and make them into a flour-like consistency. There you go, two seconds, we have our flour. Now I'm going to mix up our dates and our pumpkin. And a little swig of vanilla, tablespoon, and we'll give that a whirl. And our cranberries, pumpkin seeds, and our wet ingredients. You want to mix everything together and get all of the oats nice and wet. Now we have a nice sticky dough and we're going to put this into our pan. These are great to grab and go for breakfast. Actually it's almost like a bowl of oatmeal. There we go. We have that all even and we're going to be able to cut that into nice even little bars. I've put some chips into a bowl and we're going to microwave this and make the chocolate soft for about one minute in the microwave. Perfectly beautiful melted chocolate. And now I'm just going to pour it on the top of our bars. Mm. And we're just going to coat the top. Just gives us a nice little added yumminess. And now we will take this and we're going to freeze this and come back to it in about an hour and a half. Mmm, I just love anything that's smothered in dark chocolate. Just saying. I'm Rosie Batista, iCookNaked.com. Ciao for now while I chow on this.